Hello to our fans online. I'm Diana Perez. And I'm John Muller with the top stories on this Friday, May 24th. The main highway between Seattle and Vancouver, British Columbia is closed after a bridge collapse. Three cars fell into the Skagit River below. Divers and rescue crews and boats quickly went to work last night. At least three people were injured. The bridge was 50 years old and rated as functionally obsolete. Investigators believe there are no more victims in the river. The Highway Patrol predicts there will be traffic jams this weekend along Interstate 5. The Boy Scouts have reached a compromise on whether gays should be allowed to join the organization. After a bitter debate, the Scouts voted to open their ranks to gay boys, but not gay Scout leaders. Conservative groups are warning that the decision will lead to a mass exodus from scouting. The change takes place at the beginning of next year. The jury in Phoenix failed to agree whether to convict killer Jody Arias. Should she be put to death for her crimes? The eight men and four women could not reach a unanimous decision on that. Her conviction stands, but a new jury will be chosen for the sentencing phase beginning in about a month. And this Memorial Day weekend, there will be a flag on every grave at Arlington Cemetery. Soldiers took part in an annual ritual called Flags In, placing a small American flag on every one of the more than 280,000 graves. Memorial Day honors the men and women who have given their lives while serving in the armed forces. Happy Memorial Day. Happy Memorial Day and to everyone out there. Absolutely. Get more news anytime at abcnews.com. I'm John Muller. And I'm Diana Perez. Thanks for watching. This is World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it. ABC News, the country's premier news brand, where Americans go to see the whole picture. Together with Yahoo News, the world's number one news site on the web, this is America's number one digital news source.